All right, just so you know, my name is Ethan Carroll, officially. And um, this video can be retransmitted, rebroadcasted in any way, shape, or form. I would you my name? Uh, yeah, sure. What was your Michael name? Michael Martinez. What? Michael Martinez. Michael Martinez? Okay, and um, let me ask you a few questions. If you could say that Hanford could improve in any way, what would it be? Um, I think it would be... Uh Perhaps, you know, maybe even the cities, like, uh, getting one big city, you know. Uh, uh, from, like, Lemoore and Armona? Yeah. Like, all together in one? Yeah. You feel like it, it would be a better city to live in if it was like that? Yeah, bigger and better. So, like, if, if you could see any one business added to this area, what, what, what would you want to see? Well, the uh, any program Com Comcast are always good, you know. Comcast people are, I think, the, well, cable and or it doesn't have to be Comcast, but cable TVs are really big now, I would say. Oh, okay. And like, if you could invest in anything and money wasn't a factor, what would you invest in? Probably, probably, uh. Store. The store? Uh, yeah, that you could get to eat fast, like a fast food, you know? Fast food store? Like uh, Quiznos, maybe. Something like that? Something like that. like a that. franchise? Yeah. Okay, that sounds good, man. <laughs> One more question. Um, what do you think happens after, after life on Earth? Uh, I think... Uh, there is no right or wrong answer, so... I think some go to heaven and some go to hell, I guess. Some go to heaven and some go to hell? Yeah. Hey, man, I, I appreciate your time, though, man. Thank you for the interview. All right, my guy. If you could define yourself, how would you define yourself? As, um, challenged, uh, um, and, um, currently unemployed. Currently unemployed? Like, are you looking for a job? Uh, eventually, um, looking for a job. Trying to at least get a part-time job and see if I can, if it works out for me. You ever thought about becoming an author? Um, no, I'm not. I don't know how to type. For one thing. You know how to type? No, I'd be very slow. You know that they got a um, free college for everybody? Oh, that's wonderful. It's called um, Universal Class. All you need is a library card, man. Any local library. They got typing classes, English classes, real estate classes, business classes, you know, and um, it's available for whoever, man, honestly. It's available for anyone that wants it. Well, all right, one more question. If you could describe yourself in five words, what would they be? Describe you as a person, as a character, as whatever you wanted to be described as. That's so hard. Or the three words. To describe you, um, who you are as a man. Helpful, um, happy, and blessed. I think. Blessed, blessed to be living, huh? Yes, sir. Like, and man, one more, one more, one more. How do you think this world can be a better place as a whole? Like, how do you think this world can become a better place? You know, for everybody. If we got healthy, healthier. Healthier. Everyone got healthier. Yeah. All right, man. Appreciate your time. Thanks. All right, just so you know, just so you know, my name is Ethan Carroll, and um, this video can be retransmitted, rebroadcasted in any way, shape, or form. All right, I'm going to ask you some basic questions, all right? What do you think happens after this life? What happens after this life? Yeah, after this life that we're living on Earth right now. You get reborn again. Reborn again? Like, into what? Into a human or to, like, animal? It depends on what God wants you to be. Depends on what God wants you to be? Yeah. So, like, do you believe in heaven and hell? Yes. You believe in heaven and hell? Yes. So, like, do you think that, do you think the people that were never introduced to God are going to have a second chance to get to know Him? Yes. Because you know, like, not everyone's introduced like to church, you know? The Bible tells you it's better to know me than not to know me. And, like, do you feel like everyone who committed a sin is just going to be automatically, like, tossed into the pit of fire? No. Because you got you got a chance to repent. You gotta what? You gotta change to repent. You gotta repent? Yes. And like, alright, and um, if you could see Fresno better in any one way, what would it be? What do you mean? Like, if you could see Fresno better as a whole. 
as a city for everybody. For everybody that lives here. It would still be the same. Like, but if you could change anything about it, like, what would you change? Nothing would be all the same. It's just better it's just a little econ economy. So, like, it would be, like, more jobs for people? Yes. It's about more like, jobs, more, you know, more more, more places for them to, to, to live, you know. Like, more... Fresno, like, Fresno is a big, it's a, it's a small city, but it's not a big city to have a lot of people coming over here and a lot of people it, moving in. It's kind of big, man, honestly. It's like, it's like about, it's about like about 500,000 people. You dig? Yeah, but it's not as big like LA and all that. Yeah, it's not as big as LA though, man. Yeah. It's not as big as Chicago, it's not as big as New York. Fresno is just a little, uh, a little hole, a little hole. You know, and people moving over here because it's more, more, it's more uh, calm, calm living here. You know, it's calmed down. You know, over here. Definitely. But, you know, it's like if we have more jobs, more people will move over here, and, and the city will grow bigger. Like if you have more entertainment, huh? Yeah. No, well, I don't know about the entertainment. It'd be more jobs here. And like, all right, man. Um, if if you could be remembered in any for for anything for any accomplishment, what would you want to be remembered for by the whole world? Remember, if the whole real could remember your name for, for like for, for for something you did, like wh what would you want to be remembered for? For the city of Fresno. For the city of Fresno. Yeah. Like what about it? Well, I want to 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 help people out. Help people out over here in the city of Fresno. Yeah. Okay. Another, one more question. All right. If you could invest in anything, man, if money wasn't a factor, what would you invest in? Invest in the uh, and more. And to, uh, to make profit for yourself. Well, to make profit to myself and to invest for the people. Yeah, and, and, and mainly for you though. And more jobs. More, more jobs. jobs. Yeah. So like, you would be the person that, that creates jobs. I would. I would try to help people out. Yeah. Why not? Huh? Yeah. A little help would go a long way. They I, say. I, I, I know a lot of people that are homeless and everything, and they need jobs. And you know, you gotta get them started somehow. You know, if you don't give them the opportunity, they're not gonna give them that job. That that opportunity to to get that job. But if Definitely. you give them the opportunity. Then they'll get that job, and then they can work themselves. It's like going to school, you know? And a lot of people, they want that chance, but they don't give them that chance because they're homeless. You know, and they don't- That's just fucked up, huh? Yeah. They don't depend on them, you know? They say, nah, man, you're homeless, you're not gonna show up. You don't give them that chance. You don't give them that opportunity to, to show them- I feel themselves. like everyone deserves opportunities yes. for a better future. Exactly. You know? Yeah. Like regardless of what you've done, you feel me? Yeah. Regardless of your past history, regardless of all that, you feel me? All right, I got one final question for you, my guy, and then we then we gonna be good. Yeah. All right. If you could change the world right now, how would you change it? The real. The world. The like, world. The world we're living in. The world. If I would change it right now. If you could change anything about the world right now, what would you change? I wouldn't change nothing because God made this world, and I won't go against God. Hey man, man, thank you for your time. Appreciate that, my guy. For me. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna ask you a few basic questions, and just so you know, this video can be retransmitted, rebroadcasted in any way, shape, or form. Okay. And um, well, what do you think happens after this life?
remember for any one accomplishment, what would you be your, your member for? The artwork. Now, if you could change the world in any one way, what would it be? And I just want to let you know this video can be retransmitted, rebroadcasted in any way, shape, or form. And uh, I'm going to ask you some, a few basic questions. Um, what do you think happens after this life? I think you go to heaven. And you go to heaven? Like, do you think like everyone that committed a sin is just like completely disqualified from heaven? No. Uh, I feel like everyone has a chance to make it up. So, like, you think those people that, that weren't taught like the word are, are going to be opportunity you know to learn it no i mean it'll be up to god decision at the end of the, of the day i'll show you on that now if you could invest in anything money wasn't a factor to make money for yourself what would you invest in oil because i think gas prices is, is an issue i concur so you so you you start your own gas business? Yes, sir. At cheaper prices than everybody else? Yes, sir. Hey, why not? I feel you on that. Now, if you could see the city that you're living in better than any one way, what would it be? Probably supportive. I think uh, we have a good support system in Hanford. And then everyone just got got each other's back here, no matter, no matter what it is. So you would make like everyone that lives here have each other's back? Yes, sir. All together? Yeah. All for one? And one for all. Yep. I feel you on that. Now, one final question, my friend. If you could be a member for anything, like any accomplishment, man. Like, by the whole world forever, what would you be remembered for? The person who found the cure for cancer. Hey, hey. I feel you on that, man. Thanks for your time. Yes, Appreciate sir. it. This is Ethan Carroll speaking. Man, you could be anywhere you want to be, man, with the right amount of dedication, motivation, and determination. You could get there, man. You could be where you want to be. You can live the life that you want to live. You can accomplish your dreams. You can do it, my friends. You can do it.